I have to talk to you about this because I don't even know if you're aware of this kind of silliness. But Valentine's Day is Sunday. And there are a lot of single women, myself included, but I actually don't feel bad about Valentine's Day because I do think it's a bit of nonsense because I have a lot of married friends and folks whose relationships I really admire who don't even celebrate it. So I'm like, okay, whatever. But there are a lot of people that feel bad about that kind of thing. And I love your spirit because you just got engaged at the age of 75, which is so legendary to me. So, ladies, let me just say, I was convinced that other people would have soulmates, that it wasn't for me. And at 65, Ian Schrager, who's been my friend for life, um, said, I have somebody I want you to meet. And I thought for sure it was about business. Um, Mm -hmm. And he said, no, 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 um, it's for you. And I thought, oh, really? But... What what's really important and and it's and Valentine's obviously is not the important thing. The important thing that I learned and the reason it took me so long to find my soulmate and I thought about this so much and I really want to share it and I want you all to think about this and give yourselves a Valentine's gift by starting to do this. I realized that my career was such a big part of who I am and successful and ups and downs and all of that. But I have my identity through that. I, I, I had friends, lots of things going on, but I was attracting. What's the word I want to use when we discuss men that are not worthy. Anyway. Oh, assholes. (laughs) That's a good one. I like that one. So, um, (laughs) So I was just attracting, not horrible guys, but just not worthy, right? Mm -hmm. And the way that what you want is just not to have somebody there. You want, you want to have somebody you deserve. And the way you get somebody you deserve is you have to really focus on self-love. And I don't mean it narcissistically. Mm -hmm. Mm-hmm. I don't mean go out and buy 50 more things to make you happy for a minute. Yep. I am talking about taking care of yourself 